review. A little vacation solo review. So I believe Kyle and Mike are gonna be doing a collaboration on this, but I wanted to do this. Um, a little bit of a solo review, so I brought some cans up. This is a collaboration between Revolution, um, Re Revolution Brewing in Chicago and Hot Butcher Brewing out of Chicago too. Um, well, they're out of, uh, not Chicago, but the, the, the Chicago area. So um, Dan Jetsa did the can art for this. So there's three collabs. There's a Hazy Imperial IPA, there's a Pilsner, um, and then this is the West Coast, um, West Coast Pale Ale, 6%, um, Citra, Cashmere, Centennial, Amarillo, Chinook, I think that's it. I just looked it up, but I'm using my phone to record, so can't necessarily uh, do that. So, and proper glassware, courtesy of my cousin Steven. This is a Revolution Brewing um, pint glass um, that I haven't really been using too much just because, you know, beer snob, tulips, tikus, uh, Kolsch glasses. Uh, but I figured this was perfect, so I actually brought this glass up. And uh, let's get this in the glass. I could have done this in my Hot Butcher. Um, uh, Hopsolator, my hot butcher Yeti, but I decided not to. Maybe I'll do the the hazy IPA out on the river. So yeah, we're on vacation, we're on the river in New Hampshire. I don't know what river it is, but uh, we just got out of the kayak. We're gonna go back in. Thought I'd do a quick beer review. So proper glass for again. This beer is golden, almost. It's got an amber hue to it. Um, Port it got about two fingers ahead. Uh, anything else about this beer that we know of? Nope. So there's no um, characters on this, but yeah, this is called Base. Um, badass can art. So some buildings, like a robot building with a mallet and some extra feet and some and some shovels. Dan Dan Jet's always killing it with the uh, with the artwork. Let's go nose. Mm. Hoppy, piney, little bit of lemongrass, and you're still getting a tidge, a, a kiss of this like malt backbone. It's got that resininess, like it's got that, it's got that West Coast style. Anyways, it's good, it's good taste. Cheers. Oh, that's good. It's super crisp, super refreshing. And for six percent, when they say West Coast, I, I misread it originally. I thought I, I thought I read, I, I, I said it right on camera, but before when I was looking at this beer, I thought it was a West Coast IPA. You can definitely tell that this is a more of a pale ale because you definitely get that that more of that malt character coming through. Really nice caramel sweetness, a little bit of brown bread. Um, really, really, really delicious. It, it's just super effervescent too. Like I'm just chugging this beer right now. Part of me wants to pour this back into the can, put it in the koozie, and drink it on the, and drink it on the water. But um, piney resinous kind of bitters off at the end. Grapefruit pith. Really, really just kind of, it leaves that like hop resin, hop, 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 hop particulate on the, on the end of the beer as it finishes. Kind of a medium mouthfeel. Yeah, just like nice tropical fruits. Um, no, you're drinking a beer. But anyways, down in the comments, if you've had Revolution and Hop Butcher's base, their 6% uh, West Coast style pale ale collaboration, what do you think about Revolution? What do you think about Hop Butcher? Uh, down in the comments. We've done a good amount of Revolution reviews in the beginning of, of the channel, it feels like. I think my cousin was sending them, and I, and I actually was, and I, and I was out there visiting. I bought a bunch back. Uh, we haven't done much much as of late. This is the first one, I think, in a couple of years. Um but yeah, be on the lookout for the rest of the collabs, and hopefully, um, we definitely have some revolution in the in the cellar. So maybe once Mike and I get back together, we'll hit some of those up. But yeah, there's test.net, Instagram, Facebook, Twitter. If those are your things, please like, comment, subscribe. Also, thank you to Hop Butcher for for sending this this can. I should have said that to begin with. Um, as is always, much appreciated. This is great. And I'm gonna go uh, jump back on the river and uh, maybe do another review or two. So be on the lookout. Anyways, nerdsense.net, Instagram, Facebook, Twitter. If those are your things, I already said that. I'm Sean. This is Nerdsense. Cheers.